do not be alarmed by my eyebrows. I know that they're very vicious, they're very aggressive. I have just had them stabbed for 40 minutes straight for my annual microblading. I am at Heathrow. And you know what we like to do at Heathrow to burn time? What's that? We like to have a look at the luxury shops. We like to see what's new, what's happening. So I think we have, I think we need to have a little look around. Sadly, as we know, we don't really have duty free shopping here in the UK anymore, but I know that they're working to change that. Fingers crossed that goes through, but all of the links to these items will be below or in the shopping product on the screen. Let's go. Starting off strong at Chanel and there is, uh, I'm, I've pretty much got the shop to myself. So let's have a great time. So we've got, so these are from the Cruise Collection, these tiny little, the tennis racket is a mirror as far as I'm aware. So this one's in canvas. I've seen a couple of um, leather ones around as well. Again, some more Cruise pieces. Forgive me, I couldn't find a lot of the Chanel pricing on their app. So I've included what I could find, what I couldn't find. I apologize. I mean, this is great. Look at this, look at this tweed bonnet. I don't even want to look and yet. I see my hand fishing. Oh, oh, it's a stab in the heart, isn't it? That's lovely. Nice little, little t-shirts, what else? Very Elle Woods approved. How do I feel about this? I actually feel like it might work with the shorts, like biker shorts peeking out from underneath. I thought we'd, I thought we'd been rid of the biker shorts, but apparently Virginie said no. This. Mm -mm. This is giving your grandmother's crochet for a for a family holiday somewhere. No. Ah, yes, the Chanel 22. Though this is the small size and this is the denim. Thoughts, silver hardware. Obviously, primarily everything sort of comes in gold or the gold tone, the sort of champagne. With its little handles. Oh, oh, dear. Oh, there we go. <laughs> oh, oh. oh. I thought we were doing so well and then oh, why did why did that have to be cut why couldn't that just be a normal t-shirt trainers what's new these in the mesh with the silver details a little Chanel there 1130 these have got a bit of like neoprene but also this vaguely reminds me of um, a walking shoe so it's not necessarily something that I want to sort of come to Chanel for but these are lovely really like those and in that color as well you know me though I love I love this style 950 the very classic trainer style it's giving Yankees Stadium is it not um that's that's all I have to say about this I think we have got these which my mother has taken a shine to and is buying and I will say I have put my feet in there extremely comfortable because all of this is padded. Now, I will also say though that she is having to size up a full size. So there you go, that's my advice. 1,300, you've got all these little Chanel embellishments, these little charms, and it also does come in the beige. This is giving, this is 4th of July. Oh, she's got all the American references for us today. Ballet flats galore, sandals. Petition to call them sandals to give them a little bit of a little bit of pizzazz. These boots are great. I actually prefer it in this because this leather just looks softer. With the patent toe with the CC. 1250. This has got a little oh dear. Chanel anklet, which I do find extremely adorable. I'm not a ballet flat girl, but if I was, you know, I also don't do white. However, if this shoe was a completely different style in a different colour, avec anklet, then I would love it. That's got a sock in it. Is this the tiniest kitten heel we've ever seen? Possibly. So tiny. With a snout. What else do we have again? more of those more of these does this work does this oh the little turn lock does work okay well i enjoy that i enjoy the the fact that it's not just there for the aesthetics loafers this is a lovely khaki i will say actually no it's more of a, it's an olive green it's an olive green cassie get your shades right and then you've got patent i'm telling you now patent is having a moment patent shoes patent bags get on it that dress is fantastic i love this dress it's got a matching cardigan it's so cute. It's like a little sort of, you know, cricket jumper as a dress. And that's, you see, that's nice. I'm into this. I'm here for those vibes. 
Oh, sunglasses. <gasps> These. Thoughts. Actually, I have something similar to this. We need something with a little bit more Chanel pizzazz, I feel. Okay, these. I've got these little Chanel trims. Let's have a look. There's three different styles of these. Oh, you. No, these are a bit too like, slim, I think, for me. What about these? These have got some, some CC quilting. Oh, she's kind of, oh, she's kind of giving it, isn't she? Hello. They also come in black. They are also loving a little, um, a little chain. And it's got little CCs on it to dangle down. Look like Iris Apfel in the best way, legend. Oh, I think she actually turned 101. Shout out to Iris. What else have we got? Fashion jewelry, the belts. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. Um, oh, I really, oh, do I love this hair bow? I think I love this hair bow. Does it come in black? Does this not look like an ice cream? That looks like an ice cream, doesn't it? This folds into itself. So in case your bag for life isn't good enough, you can do that. Why not? More of these oh, little earrings. What have we got? Little danglies. These always do so well, don't they? Everybody loves these. You can't not. This little Chanel Coco, these little hoops that have the CC detail inside and some brooches as well. Yellows and whites. This is very Easter, Easter friendly. Little ones. Okay, so this is a new travel bag that I think they've just come out with for this season. It's huge, it's roomy. I think it's like £5,700-ish. Um, I want to say it also comes in beige, but I may be lying, so double check that. I mean, it's very light, it's lambskin. It doesn't give me a pizzazz, but it does give me classic. Now, I think this is an actual tennis racket case. Go for it. Oh, okay, I've just seen these little details on that. Oh uh, yeah, she is quite literally serving. She's serving the aces. But um, look at this. I like this little one. A little fold over. Okay, what else have we got? There's this sort of, there's a mini Harrods here, by the way. It's just got a little bit of Max Mara. Oh, it's all right, yeah. Good little selection, some Longchamp. Um, Cartier. Um, there is Gucci in Burberry. There has been nothing new in Gucci. Of these, but these nice. I think the colour's great because it's quite see-through. And then you've got the little obliques all over. The trainers. These are the trainers I have with the gold that Nia famously hates, but with a bit of sort of a, a rosy beige trim. That's some here, some high tops, riding boots. Very equestrian. These are nice. These are nice boots with a bit of their leather with some rubber details around the toe, around the back. More ballet flats, as we know. Everybody loves them at the moment, apparently. These ones have got little holes for your toe cleavage. So there we go, with little ankles, two ankle straps there. So this D-Joy is one size smaller than the one that I currently have. I have the medium, this is the small, they also do do a micro. I'm now in Louis Vuitton and these are like little troll shoes. Balenciaga did something very similar to these and I didn't think that they needed to be replicated and yet here we are. They are foam, I'm sure that they're comfy. They look cumbersome in my opinion. What do I know? Not these. Right, well you weren't missing out on Louis Vuitton. Also don't say anything about my patchy makeup, okay? Had to apply over makeup that was half off from the microblading, okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> Vuitton was old, like old stuff in there. Let's have a look at Fendi because they've got some new stuff. Aha, so you know the satin, one of these that I've got in red. These are what the patent ones look like. I do think that they look a little bit more, uh, what's the word? A bit more substantial. 
than the satin one. Obviously a very different look. So they've got it in this beautiful coral, the green and black as well. So I told you patients having a moment. Look at all this travel collection. Okay, firstly love, of course, classic. Not, not, you know, nothing crazy going on here, but always a winner. But I love this. And this little like travel bag for your cosmetics. I've never, I've never seen Fendi travel before. Burberry. Now, although we know Burberry's ushering in a new era, I thought, let's see, because it's a huge store and um, they might have, they might have some goodies. You know, let's always keep an open mind. Why not? Beautiful store. I think this is the men's side. Lot of classic pieces. I will say I like this. I mean, we're looking at a lot of wash bags, but that's nice with just the little orange pop in the Nova check can get the normal Nova check, but that, that seems like a lot to me. This seems, this seems nice. 420 for all your bathroom needs. I love this. It feels very soft. It's not cashmere, but it does feel very cozy. It's a lovely cardigan in a beige and white Nova check. You see, I like you. TB, I mean, we can talk about the TB until the cows come home, can't we? And then you've got the classic in like a darker brown and a lighter brown as well and you've got the TV once again just reminding us all yeah men's bags and backpacks and the men's section okay oh, in the men's section but they've got the shorts that match the cardigan and I just think the cardigan and the shorts you know if they came in sort of smaller sizes or whatever would be so cute and then they also do the top versions are, oh my gosh, stop. That's a fantastic combo. Oh, that's a glorious combo, Cassie. God, these sort of pull-on cargos for men. That, honestly, might be worth a try for the ladies as well because they're very simple. Then again, are they too simple that it's not even worth buying, you know? You know what I mean? Where's the design pizzazz? Oh, you've got a little bit of Burberry on the bum, so maybe that's it. This is the Bulgari Serpenti watch in the white ceramic with two twists. So you can get it with a sort of quote unquote shorter watch strap that only has one twist. But I could not help but try this on. It was just magnificent. This may be a mini shopping vlog because I mean there's not been there's not been that many um like you know, new stuff, fun stuff. It's all been stuff that we've seen before. And you know, I don't want to waste your time. It's short, it's short, forgive me. I look down. I look like a raccoon, I can see myself. Either way, I hope you enjoyed a bit. I'm going to leave a link to another video over here in case you haven't already seen it. Have an amazing morning, afternoon or evening, wherever you are. In the words of my father. If you've enjoyed it, tell your friends. If you haven't, keep your mouth shut. Oh, and I bought something. Guess what it is. It's small. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.